Hey everybody, hey everybody, Jeremy Redman here. Uh, gonna demo you today. Gonna demo you today. Like, subscribe, just get right that, get get all that out of here. All right, now that all that's out of the way, I just wanna, uh, we're just gonna walk you through. By the way, happy holidays, okay? Happy holidays. Um, I think I recorded this a little bit before, but I wanted to get it out now um, as just had a new addition to the family and I've been going through all that stuff holidays, blah, 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 chaotic, chaotic. So, but wanted to get you this video anyway. What about all this rambling? Okay, get all the rambling out. Anyway, I wanted to make a scraping Yelp video. There's a lot more that goes on with this video um, and a lot more, uh, a lot of pieces outside of it. So I'll be uploading that in the next day or two um, because there's some grander context to it. But I wanted to make sure that to let you know that we could scrape Yelp, show you, um, that one customer wanted to scrape Yelp for roofers. Um, and then we'll open up some other context. But one thing we will be putting in our Google, uh, our, our Google calendar or our Calendly link, whichever one works better as a big update. Um, every, again, I'm, I'm, I'm going to, I'm going to emphasize this later on this next video because I just made it because I'm going to send it later. Okay. It just takes some editing. It's a little more editing. I am so, I am all over the place. Anyway, anyway, Rusty, Rusty, type in the comment. Just give me some support here. Hello, hello, hello. I like hearing from you guys. Um, so I wanted to let you know that we will be assisting anyone who needs it, right? Because one thing has become certain. Um, we're building a terrific community here. We're doing a lot of good things. Uh, and what's, I, I think so many people are, it either has clicked, but in my gut, I feel it's clicked for like 50% of people, right? Like, and the other 50%, maybe the other 30 or 40% are hanging on by like one little thing. Like chime in. I've always given you the latitude to yell at me on here. Or if you haven't heard back, um, again, sorry if you haven't heard back um, from us because given the holidays, right? It might take an extra day or two. Uh, thank you so much for your patience and understanding. Hasn't been that bad. We've still gotten to all emails. I do believe by now. I'm shouting out you who called me out in the comments. Um, I don't want to call your name out, but you can say hi if you want. I know you're amazing. Um, but yes, please let us know if you're struggling. We are going to start um, the live here in New Year this week, um, Thursday, Friday. So I think the first one might be Thursday or Friday. So comment if you're excited for that. Um, we're gonna do live helping. And I think it's gonna be at about 1 p.m. PST. So it we're gonna try it. Um, I think scheduled for this Friday um, at 1 p.m. PST. So Pacific Standard Time for those of you who are on the globe. And it will go in here and it will be recorded as well. So we're gonna try to do that every day. And we're going to go over our change log um, and also our request.taskmagic.com to kind of get that conversation going as well. Um, so we've had an amazing, terrific year. Um, we've got so many great, wonderful people. Pat yourselves on the back. I'm, pat I'm patting me on the back, but it's I'm patting you. Okay, so, just so you know. I don't think this is a now a Yelp video, but anyway... It's gonna, be, <laughs> there, there's gotta be some goodness at the end of this vi video for you. I just wanted to say from me and Kyle and everyone here, uh, thank you guys so much. We hope you are enjoying the tool, but our 2023 was our seeds in the ground year. 2024 is going to be not just us, but everyone who's bet on us in 2023 and in 2024, they're gonna, you're, <laughs> we're watering it and they're gonna grow. We're growing you. We're going to grow you. Okay. So if you haven't been helped or you haven't asked or you haven't yelled at me in here, you can also be nice and say hi. Okay. But I also welcome the yelling. All right. What I don't like, what I don't like is the fake yelling. So I will say this one person commented in here and I didn't like it. Um, and I wrote in there that I was going to delete it because I saw that they commented 
just some nasty stuff, which I will allow. Okay. But what I don't allow is it to be a fake account. So if you're going to chime in and say nasty stuff, totally fine. No one's experience is terrific all the time, especially when you're making a tool that is supposed to work on 95% of websites. If something doesn't work on that site from like Pakistan or something like, cause it's got 80 million ads on it or something like, just let us know and we'll get to it. <laughs> right. But if it's a low volume site, it's not the top priority. So you might get stuck and please forgive us, but we will get to it and we will help you. Um, that's our promise eventually. So a little bit of that housekeeping, but chime in, have it be real. Don't, I, I saw this person poop talked, poop talked us. And th in th it was like three hours ago or something. And then I saw, cause you can click on their thing and see when the account was created and the account was created also three hours ago. <laughs> so don't do that. If you're gonna poop talk, poop talk with your name behind it. Cause I let you poop talk, poop talk. There's so much poop talk on here. I'm, I'm saying this too often. I'm saying this too much now. Now I'm going to mark this not for kids. It's too much poop. Okay. Anyway, I'm not editing any of this, but I wanted to say thank you so much. Say hi. Uh, we appreciate you. Everyone will get a 10 minute session. Tr we'll try to get a 10 minute session. And um, we're going to start taking more community things. I know we've said we're going to do this, but we've we've experimented with some. We've got so many of the bugs out. We're now just working on UX improvements. And that's where you come in because a lot of people are just stuck on this one little thing, like a little thing or two. Um, and then when we get it, it's like, yeah, yes. Oh my God, it's amazing. So um, yeah, 2024 is our year of growth and everyone's sprouting those leaves. We're going to get you. We're going to get you. We're going to build a flow for you. Um, and we're going to see, we're going to, we're going to launch a try it right on our website where you can try to see if it works on your web on, on that web page. Um, it's really just like me or Kyle or someone behind the scenes, you, you filling out the website and then us going in there and seeing if it works and then like emailing you a video if it works. Um, and just building the relationship that way. But we're here. We're here for you. Thank you so much for a wonderful 2023. Happy New Year. Happy New Year to everyone out there. Um, make sure to say Happy New Year. Uh, we got a lot of cool things coming. Um, sorry for the little break. And we look forward to having a wonderful, prosperous for everyone here at Task Magic. Happy 2020-24. The heck was that number I just threw out there? 2024. <laughs> All right, let's see how we can scrape Yelp. We didn't need to enter it there. I just didn't realize I was in there. Okay, we're good now. So first up, we're gonna scrape a list. We're gonna get the, let's go ahead and get the name here. And then we can get, after we get the name, um, actually, I guess we just wanna duplicate this and get the links. So this gives me everybody's name and a link to their profile. Then uh, we can record a click step of clicking this next button here. Let's do this. And let's add a quick delay step so that that has time to load. And that should be it. Let's just test that and make sure that switches. And we are good. So last thing is going to be making this a loop trigger. That way it loops over things. Um, let's go ahead and change it here. We don't need data from Google Sheets because we're just going to loop, um, I think it was like, whatever, 10 times uh, because of how many times we want to click that next button. So here, uh, for the loop, we want to make sure that this loops from step two to step five because we don't want to repeat going to this page every time. We want to go there once, and then after we get to the end and click next page, we just want to scrape again. And this gets our scraped list longer and longer and longer and helps us there. So let's go ahead and run this. So I'll hit play. Um, 
and I'll probably pause after the first two loops or so because I realized I set this to 10 and that's going to take quite a while. But I'll let this start running and we can see it start populating our list and things. So we see it scrape all the names here and then it went to the next page. You'll see here that this is going to go up by 10 every time, um, just the way the URL is going to work. So we scrape another 10, now we're at the 20th result, and we'll see in the data out that we have all of those results here. So the name and the link to their Yelp profile. And this would be pushed to our Google Sheet at the end of the automation. This is just a way for us to see it during the automation. And then worst case scenario, if it doesn't get sent, uh, we can download as CSV or JSON. So this is gonna keep running. It looks like it's on this fourth loop now. I'm gonna go ahead and pause this, um, but we will see the data show up in our Google Sheets after it finishes running. For now, we're seeing all of those results in the traffic control.